Want to know the differences between the Oakley Portal and Portal X? Stay tuned for everything you need to know. What's up guys, I'm Andrew and I'm the Oakley brand ambassador at SporterX and today we'll be talking about the differences between the Oakley Portal and Oakley Portal X. Before we get too far into the frame details here though, I do want to remind you to subscribe to our channel if you like this type of content. When you subscribe, you'll be the first to know when we push out that new content every week. Also, you can always pick up the phone and contact one of our certified opticians on the phones seven days a week if you have any other questions about sunglasses, Oakley, eyeglasses, anything like that. So to give you a little bit of a backstory, the Portal X comes from that sort of main link and cross range family where you just have a very casual looking frame, but tons of sport features embedded throughout the frame. We do have a separate review of the Portal X if you're interested in diving a little bit deeper there. Since we are Sport RX with heavy emphasis on the RX, I wanna remind you that both of these are available in prescription even with progressive lenses. So let's talk about the similarities between these frames. First off, overall application, I would say these are one sunglass that can really do it all. So again, they have a very casual look, but don't be fooled by that. There's tons of grip where you need it, lots of coverage, um, a little bit of wrap as well. So you have everything that you would look for in a sport frame as well. Now, both of these are made of O matter. That's Oakley's proprietary frame material. It makes the frame super, super lightweight, but also incredibly durable, which is great for really any physical activity. They also have tons of unobtainium grip on the temples. The inside of the temples are just covered in it. There's also a nice saddle unobtainium nose bridge. Unobtainium is Oakley's proprietary grip technology, and it really gets stickier and tackier the more you sweat to keep these frames optically aligned throughout your day. Also, these come standard with prism lens technology. That's Oakley's contrast enhancing lens tech, and it helps really make everything in your environment just pop with colors. The details are easier to pick up on. Now there's three different categories of prism. There's sport, everyday, and snow. And these both come in a variety of sport and everyday options, but we have tons of reviews and other content about prism if you wanna learn more about that. As far as fit goes, both of these have a very similar Sporter X frame width measurement. So they're both sort of that medium to large fit for men, extra large for women, kind of leaning more towards, towards the large side of the spectrum there. But overall, again, the, the portal, although it has larger lenses, the overall fit is gonna be very similar to the Portal X. Both of these are available in prescription with Oakley Authentic Prism lenses or Sporter X Sport Optimized lenses. So now that we've covered the similarities, let's look at the differences between these models. So at first glance, you're gonna see the main difference is really lens size and shape of the Portal is definitely a bit taller as well as wider than the Portal X. So reasons why you might want a little bit more coverage, uh, let's say you're hitting the trails on your mountain bike or road cycling. If you just want a little bit more wind protection, don't wanna worry about your eyes watering up, probably gonna to wanna to go with this guy. Uh, this is actually sort of a, a dual lens version of the Sutro, which is a full shield sunglass from Oakley, but this one is our Xable, which we love. Um, but that's sort of the main difference between these. As far as frame material, lens tech, our ability, everything else is very, very similar as well, again, as fit. Um, but again, it's just the lens shape and size that is really the main difference there. It's up to you. Let us know what you think about these frames, which one you're super into, maybe get them both. Anyways, let us know in the comments below and we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Later.